guys welcome back to the videos we haven't done this in a very very long time I have a super busy day just running errands and personal stuff we have to do today so I thought I would go ahead and do a full day of eating for you guys to show you guys what I've been eating on my bulk now the good thing is I'm not really on a I'm not I'm not on prep right now I don't really have like a set for sure meal plan so I get to eat pretty much whatever I want to an extent even though I'm not on prep I do like to keep myself uh, accountable just so that it's easier for me when I do go on prep for my show in March. What I do now is I kind of eat what I want, still have fun, also stay to a plan. So I thought I'd go ahead and show you guys what I eat every day for my bulk to get ready for my show in March. I start prep right after Christmas, so I gotta enjoy myself as much as I can today. And I usually don't eat out, but I saved all of my eating out days, I guess, for this video so I can show you guys what I get when I actually go places. But for breakfast, we are starting out with three eggs, two egg whites and one whole egg with a chicken apple sausage uh, from Trader Joe's, just one sausage link. And I mix that up into like kind of like a scramble. It's super bomb. You guys should definitely try this if you haven't ever before. And then I do have two servings of the dark chocolate Kodiak cakes. If you don't know what Kodiak cakes are, they're just basically protein pancakes that you just mix with some water. And they're actually super good. So I'm gonna go ahead and smash both of these. I'm not counting calories, but I generally know where I sit at around 400 carbs, 300 protein, and like 75 fat. I'm noticing consistent growth. So we're gonna go ahead and smash this. And I'm gonna take you guys along for the full day of eating. Now that we finished up our breakfast, it's time to go to the gym. I usually like to set my day up to where I eat breakfast and then go right to the gym. But sometimes life gets in the way and I have to just go like super late at night. But usually, first meal, then gym, which works best for me. So, before we go to the gym, I always take <coughs> Good stuff. Before we go to the gym, I always take my pre-workout, and you guys know I use Staunch for all of my products, and if you didn't know, I have a limited edition Staunch pre-workout that is unfortunately sold out right now, but I'm actually heading there next week to possibly work on a new pre-workout and even some more product, which is gonna be super cool. But before we go to the gym, I always take my pre-workout here. Oh! Oh, it's sour grape, really sour grape. We're letting the pre-workout course through my body here. I actually just uploaded my video from yesterday and I'm gonna go through, read all of the comments so far and reply to you guys because the coolest thing to me about, about doing daily videos is getting to respond to you guys real time and look at things real time. So thank you to everybody who posts a comment. It does mean a lot and we're gonna go through these and answer all of them while we're here. We have just made it to the gym. So oh, there we go, that's helping. I actually just started a new training block to get prepared for the show. Originally, I was doing one body part a day. Now I'm working with my training coach that I did for last prep, and we are doing a pull legs push split. Today is Wednesday, so it's my first push day. So I'm gonna take you guys along for my entire push day, and it's gonna be a good one because shoulders and chest are my two favorite things to work, and that's exactly what we have today. So let's go get a good pump. No help, that's all me. Cut on the jail of the army. Remember when they didn't want to call me? Now I can't keep a ass off me. Need no help, that's all me. Cut on the jail of the army. Remember when they didn't want to call me? Should have seen a look when they saw me. Need no help, that's all me. Cut on the jail of the army. Remember when they didn't want to call me? Now I can't keep a ass off me. Need no help, that's all me. Cut on the jail of the army. Remember when they didn't want to call me? Should have seen a look when they saw me. Me. They ain't happy, they just shot Kill Nipsey, they touch pot Can't believe that I made it here Niggas bust rounds in my bus stop No help, all me get money on three game plan In the hills talking real figures Got heel figure on the waistband Like four bands, four hours, fuel efficient Just know I get it done Life a dream, life a game, all the same Look like I really won Roll the dice, you can bet that Came back from a setback Front pocket full of head pack. Show, then I head back like hold up. Watch 
how you talk to me, I be too petty for play I need my fatty today, waking up early so I get ahead of the day It worked for me better that way, better go get it, you young and you able They did not save us a seat at the table, I did it all with no help from a label Came a long way just from stealing that cable, I'm teed up, drip down, uh Save it, hoe, sit down, uh I don't need a cosign, huh Need a new phone line, I Think I'm too full of myself and they full of that hatred, they hated to see it, I Could've went to jail of the army Remember when they didn't wanna call me Now I can't keep a ass off me Need no help, that's all me Could've went to jail of the army Remember when they didn't wanna call me Should've seen a look when they saw me Need no help, that's all me Could've went to jail of the army Remember when they didn't wanna call me Now I can't keep a ass off me Need no help, that's all me Could've went to jail of the army Remember when they didn't wanna call me Should've seen a look when they saw me they ain't cheering, they just doubting. Kill Sebby, they touch Malcolm. Meanwhile, I bought a Cuban link. I might upgrade it, might bust down it. Shine hard like I'm post tool. I'm a king nigga in a slum village. When you speaking that real shit, even though it's claiming ain't nothing feel it. I can see the envy. No, he wanna hide it, but it's coming through. I ain't seen nobody. Before I seen the paper, who the fuck is you? Mandatory that I keep on guessing. I'm a pop quiz and a pot luck. Turn a win to a winning streak just to show these niggas that it's not luck. Pop out on fresh off a plane. Tell him that daddy is home. Truly, he glad to be home. These niggas gravity prone. Tell by the way that he look and he mad that he on. I've been on 10 with the shit. 10 to the hoes in the market until there's no hoes in my pocket. These niggas tend to be lying and tend to be hating on me because I told them to stop it. Totally opposite every opinion. I'm doing whatever I'm feeling. Seem like the only few times when I asked for advice, what they gave me was never appealing. Lately, I feel like the man, yeah, the man that I told you one day I would be. They wanna know how I do what I do. Might be something to you, but it's nothing to me. Need no help, that's all me. Could've went to jail or the army. All right, we have made it home, and I just realized from my post-workout meal, I usually have ice cakes, but I think I ate all of them yesterday, so know what you guys get. By the way, if you put the milk before the cereal, all right, so. I'm gonna knock stuff down. For today's post-workout meal, if you guys have watched the fitness videos before, you guys know I make a super bomb post-workout meal with protein and rice cakes and kind of like makes like, like ice cream in a way, I don't know. But unfortunately, I ate all of them yesterday. So for today, for today's full day of eating, you guys get about four servings of cereal and two scoops of protein. Oh. <laughs> The best part about not being on prep is getting to have my carbs in whatever form that I want, including cereal. After I eat this, the next order of business that I have to do today is, number one, get this cut. I have a Christmas party for Tiana's work this weekend and I can't go looking like this. So get a haircut as well as I need to do some preparation for Japan and I need to be able to drive in Japan. So last year, my international driver's permit, but it only lasts for one year. So if you guys can see here, it expires on January 9th, 2019. Oh, it's only valid one year from January 9th, 2019. So by the time I get to Japan, this won't work anymore. So I have to go to AAA and get a new international driving permit so that while we're over there, we can do tons of cool stuff, go see cool things and get to drive our own car. We're gonna take care of that today and we're gonna get it all done while eating some good food. It's been a couple hours, but we made it to AAA and we also got a fresh haircut, thankfully. So, like I said, in order for me to drive the new project in Japan, I have to go renew my international driving permit right here. Hopefully they can do it. I kind of came pretty late, but we're about to go in AAA and renew this. Boom. Mission accomplished exactly one year later, and I thought it was only necessary to take the R32 to prepare me 
to drive the new project in Japan. Now, I am officially legal to drive over in Tokyo. I am so stoked, and we had to take the R32 in honor of our Japan trip. So, now that I'm officially legal, we are completely set to head over to Japan. I am so stoked. Tonight, we actually have a shoot with the R32 and all the new Legends merch. So, my friend John, you guys have seen him in a couple of other videos, is gonna come out tonight, and we are gonna do an awesome little JDM shoot with all of the new merchandise, and it'll be the R32's first shoot with the new Nismo wheels too. Ooh, I am so excited right now. So, this was the last thing that we had to do to get ready for Tokyo. Let's head home. All right, we have a new. Are you going to subscribe? You don't know. You just. Oh! Right oh, yeah, there. Bro. Oh, look, even. Post notifications. Oh, oh my dude. Hey, Let's thanks, go. bro. I appreciate it, man. See ya. Sick car, bro. Thank you. It's always so cool getting to meet new people through cars. Like, you saw my car, thought it was cool. I was doing some filming, and then you noticed that I had a YouTube channel. So, that's always really, really cool. I hope you end up watching this, bro. Come on, baby. Ah, yeah. Oh, yeah. Meal number three, which I am super late, by the way. I usually don't eat this late. But meal number three, seven ounces of shrimp, which I, I put teriyaki sesame sauce on, which is freaking bomb, by the way. And 225 grams of fried rice. I just put some soy sauce and rice into a pan, fried it up a little bit, and now we have some shrimp fried rice. This is so bomb. I'll show you guys the sauce real fast that I used. So the, uh, this is the specific sauce that I use. I got this from Walmart. The macros aren't terrible, but they're also not the best. You guys can get sugar-free, fat-free teriyaki sauce, but since I'm not on prep, this has a little bit more flavor and it has like the sesame seeds on the inside, which is super good. Final thing for today, we are gonna end out today with full shoot of all the new legend stuff dropping this Sunday on the 15th at 10 a.m. Pacific time. Of course, I had to have my boy John come and shoot everything. He has done the last few drops. He does an incredible job. So if you guys wanna follow out his work, I'll put his Instagram on the screen for you guys. But he's gonna be doing a full shoot of all of the amazing stuff uh, that we're dropping this Sunday. It's gonna be great. I know. We freaking killed it. Yo, Dude, how guys, sick is this spot? Out. <laughs> Holy shit, like, look at this. <laughs> Oh my god, bro. It looks, it looks so weird. killer right here, dude. Oh, just with like the LMGT. John, you're the first person to shoot this car on the LMGT2s, by the way. So killer, dude. But John, successful shoot, man. I cannot wait to edit these pictures and show you guys. Be sure to, number one, follow John. He has really amazing automotive photography. But if you want to see these pictures, be sure to follow me and the Legends Instagram account if you guys want to see all of the pictures of the new stuff. This winter jacket has got to be probably my favorite thing coming with this drop so cool and i cannot wait to rock this at tokyo auto salon so cool to have my own merch going to japan with me but john i have a present for you i know that you said you really like the blanket bro 
Yo. Brand new blanket for hey. you, dude. Shout out to Dustin. Thank you for having me, bro. I really appreciate it. Of course, I appreciate Yo. you, dude. John, feel how I want you to feel how soft that is, dude. It's like, holy, oh, bro. <laughs> I'll literally crash out in like 25 seconds with this thing on, bro. <laughs> Quick question, John. We have two choices. I'm doing a full day of eating here. Would you rather In and Out or some really, really bomb Mexican food? Mexican food. Mexican food. Yeah. We're going. Let's go. But but you have to get a burrito. All right. Mexican food it is. Sure. All right, let's get out of here. I cannot get over how good the car looks in this spot, though. Not yet. Bro, yeah. how is it burrito? You are not kidding, dude. It's literally the size of a freaking baby, bro. <laughs> Yo. So, yeah, whenever I want some Mexican food, this is the place I go to. It's called Colima's, and they have the best Mexican food. I'll either go for the pollo asado plate or the carne asado plate because you get... <laughs> it's literally a baby, dude. <laughs> it's literally, you get tortillas on the sides, so like you can make a plate and a burrito. It's like a two-in-one here, but this is gonna be my cheat meal for today, and we'll have one more meal after this, but... <laughs> bro, it's big, bro. I'm out. <laughs> Post-shoot meal. Oh, clean plate here. I think John's Yo. tapping out. Yo, burrito one? <laughs> yeah, you, <Easy. laughs> you probably have a solid two pounds of burrito inside of you right now. That was good though. Really good. <laughs> it has been uh, it has been quite a few hours since the last clip John left and I was supposed to have one more meal, but I actually just opted for a protein shake because it is 12.15 in the morning. I got super caught up finishing up this video and check out all of these awesome photos. They came out so good. So I'm very excited. I went ahead and edited all the pictures and now I'm just finishing up the video. So I'm gonna go ahead and end this here because I have to wake up in a few hours and start this all over again. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget that this Sunday at 10 a.m. Pacific time, we are dropping all of the new Legends merchandise as well as from 12 to 4 p.m. on Sunday, we are also having a toy drive slash car show. So if you wanna come hang out and bring your car, come to an awesome little car show at Garage Legends and support a good cause by bringing a toy, that would be amazing. I hope I can see all of you guys there. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.